But gratitude has been a predominant attitude in Tampa's Christian circles, as it looks like the city will escape much of Isaac's wrath. Reverend Justin Peters is part of an effort to cover the party conventions in prayer. And she says there's been plenty of prayer about Isaac in the last few days. We have had lots and lots of people praying uh, around the clock that it would move. And if you watch the, from the very beginning where they were saying it was coming and now where they're saying it's going, then it has really moved out of the way for us. And we appreciate God doing that and moving it for us. Let me be clear. We're going to have a zero tolerance for lawlessness during this emergency um, and, and to make sure that this city is secure. In that regard, uh, we are going to join with Jefferson Parish that just uh, decided to institute a curfew. Uh, now that this storm is going to be with us for some time and is going to begin to stress the system, we have to make sure uh, that the streets are clear uh, and safe. And so uh, at, uh, today uh, it's going to begin.